Millie the police motorbike has had to stop Larry the lorry. He delivers parcels and packages all over the country. He looks so full, his sides might burst. Millie needs to escort Larry to Gecko's garage so that we can help him. Garage doors open at speed. It's time to help, a vehicle in need. Hiya Larry, it looks like you're carrying too many packages and they haven't been loaded very well. Shall we take a look? Go, go mechanicals! What a mess, I'm really sorry, but that's no way to pack a lorry. Let's take some time and care with it. I'm sure we'll make these boxes fit. The biggest parcel should go in first. With the smallest one on top. That blue parcel on the left. And the red one on the right. Let's put this parcel in the gap up at the top. And put the last parcel in that gap down at the bottom. There, all sorted. Now that everything is packed away neatly, it all fits in properly. See you again soon, Larry. Good luck with all your deliveries. Thanks for helping me out today at Gecko's Garage. Join me next time when we help another vehicle in need. Bye! Rick the Road Roller is at the construction site today. He helps Danny the Digger and his other friends by making surfaces flat and safe to drive on. Without him, vehicles would have a very bumpy ride. Rick can flatten soil, sand, concrete, tarmac or even gravel. Ah, it looks like Celia's filling that deep hole with concrete. When concrete dries, it's rock hard and good to build on. Oh no! Look out, Rick! Don't roll into that concrete. It's only just been poured and it's far too deep. Uh-oh, too late. Oh dear. Rick is stuck and Caroline the Crane's at another job and she's not here to pull him out. This looks like a job for Helen the Helicopter. Go, go, Helen! Get you back to the garage and fix you up. Garage roof open at speed. It's time to help a vehicle in need. Did you enjoy your flight, Rick? Let's take a good look at you. Oh dear, you're well and truly stuck in that concrete. Don't worry, the mechanicals will get you out in no time. Go, go, Mechanicals! It must have been an awful shock. To get stuck in concrete, that hardens like rock. Please don't worry, without a doubt, the Mechanicals jackhammers will break you out. There, as good as new. Let's go outside and test your roller to make sure everything's in full working order. Careful Mechanicals, stand well back. We don't want you getting squashed. OK Rick, squash those shapes. The first shape to squash is over here. A big round ball we call a sphere. Rick rolls it flat 
and then we find a circle has been left behind. A big tall pointy pyramid, the second shape that Rick has hid. Rick rolls it flat and now we've found a triangle left on the ground. This one has six faces all the same. A cube is its name. Rick rolls it flat and now down there we have a perfect flattened square. The final one to be destroyed, a shoebox shape. It's a cuboid. Rick pushes down, the shape is mangled and now we have a flat rectangle. Very impressive, Rick. Looks like you're back to your old self again. You'd better get back to the construction site. Danny the digger will be worried about you. I'm glad we could get Rick out of that concrete and back to normal. He'll have to watch where he's going in future so that he doesn't get into any more trouble. See you all again soon. Bye! Ryan the Wrecking Ball Crane is smashing an old wall at the construction site today. And here comes Rick the Road Roller. I don't think he's looking where he's going. Look out, Rick! Uh-oh! Too late! Ooh, what a nasty smash! The mechanicals are getting the garage ready for our poorly friend, Rick the Road Roller. Rick carries a big heavy drum in front of him, which he uses to flatten roads. That makes them nice and smooth. Rick's drum should be a cylinder shape, but that smash from Ryan has made it go all wonky. Garage doors open at speed. It's time to help a vehicle in need. Hello, Rick. Wow, you really do have a problem today. Your drum is all broken and twisted. I think it needs replacing. Let's fit you a new one. Oh, Rick, what a mess you've got yourself in. Your drum's all twisted, and now it won't spin. We'll find a nice new drum just for you. Let's fix you up. There good as new. Hmm, that new drum doesn't look like the old cylinder. I think that's a sphere. A sphere is different from a circle. A circle is round and flat. A sphere is round but solid, just like a ball. Let's test it out. I don't think this sphere is the right shape for Rick's drum. It's making Rick all dizzy and confused. Let's go back inside and try again. Don't worry Rick, no need to fear. The mechs will soon replace that sphere. Swap out the drum and look at that. A cylinder whose sides are flat. Oh dear mechanicals, that's not a cylinder shape. It's a cuboid. A cylinder has to be round. Rick can't roll a road using a shape with flat sides. All that thumping is giving Rick a headache. Now the mechs know what to avoid. Drums that are spherical or cuboid. What's this drum they're trying to wrangle? I don't like the look of that triangle. That triangular prism isn't right either. Mechanicals, are you trying to make Rick crash? Oops, too late. There we go. That's a cylinder and it fits just right. The rounded shape is perfect for Rick to move around on and roll things flat. 
Rick, if you wouldn't mind just smoothing out the damage to the car park before you head off, that would be much appreciated. Let's hope you won't be needing a new cylinder anytime soon, Rick. We need you out there rolling our roads. Thanks for helping me out today at Gecko's Garage. Join me next time when we help another vehicle in need. For now, it's Cheerio from Gecko. Bye!